Hey everyone, what's going on? This is Ryu here. I thought I would do it, but talk about a few things that's just going on with me for right now here, though. Um, first of all, I thought I would get up and say, Hey, hi, how's everybody doing? What's going on with everybody? Hope everybody's doing okay. You know, hope everybody had a good week. Hope nothing stressful happened to nobody. You know, hope yay things happen to people. You know, everything went smoothly, nothing wrong happened, mission accomplished. Um, nothing, you know, nothing really much really happened with me the whole entire week. I just kind of just, you know, played stuff, uploaded a couple things. Um, first of all, I thought I'd like to get up and say thank you for everybody who kind of saw my, um, my Fantasy Star 3 and my Metroid, and my Metroid playthroughs I did. Um, Fantasy Star 3, I actually started getting adjusted to actually playing that game when I actually got my copy of um, the Sega Genesis collection for the PlayStation Portable was when I started getting accustomed to it. Um, I did actually have a copy of, of the Fan Star collection for the Game Boy Advance. Unfortunately I wasn't necessarily good at, you know, then when I first played it. At first I at first I was kinda like, um, you know, it's it's really hard. You can re you can easily get lost in areas and um I would get stuck. And one thing I hear about that game is though is the fact that um in the past the way it used to be was the if I played another game and I came back to it, I would easily get lost because I wouldn't have a down I wouldn't have a darn clue where I'm going. Now I know where I'm going because I played it so much. But yeah. I mean, not, 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 you know, not trying to sit here and brag or anything, but, you know, after playing it so much on my PlayStation Portable, I, um, actually had, you know, I actually know what I'm, what I'm going now, what I'm doing. Um, now, I only showed you one of the four endings. There's actually, I mean, like I said, there's actually four endings, and I only showed you one of them. Um, later on, it'll probably be, I don't know when, I might actually sit down and do another storyline and just showing you if you decide to not marry Maya but you decide to marry the other girl um which pathway you go to where you have to go what you have to do and then go fight Dark Forest and then show you they show you that ending but that'll be sometime down the down the road there for right now um also I thought I would get up and also say you know thank you for everybody you know I know I said before but once again thank you for everybody who watched my Metroid playthrough you know thank you very much for doing that um Metroid was actually another one of my funny fun funny ugh, I can't talk today fun games after Super Metroid when I first heard the um boss theme and the escape music I was a huge fan of Metroid then and like I've played like all the Metroid games mostly besides the ones on um there on the GameCube and the Wii and mostly cuz um a lot of the times when I first heard about Prime a lot of people telling me that it was first person it wasn't all that gameplay wasn't all that cuz it's first person you can easily you know you know you can easily like judge the jump and totally miss it entirely and fall like 50 feet and do stuff like this and you know, how is it paying the bud and raging and ugh. And I was like, oh, so, you know, by the time, I mean, I mean by the time we get the choice for either um, Play, PlayStation 2 or GameCube, I actually went and got myself a PlayStation 2. It was a used PlayStation 2, but it's a PlayStation 2 regardless. So I went that route, and I didn't really think about actually getting the GameCube or Wii and now a lot of people kind of got up and said you know when I, when I say something about Metroid and a lot of people kinda say something about Metroid Prime and I say I never played Metroid Prime before people get up and go oh my god you have to play Metroid Prime Metroid Prime is like the most amazing game of all time you have to play this game and I'm just like well maybe if I get me a job I mean maybe if a job comes my way and it pays me a good amount of money or something, I'll um, take care of that, and I'll try out Prime for myself and see how it is. I mean, I have actually like listened to like some of the music before in the past. I was like, well, you know, the music stuff sounds pretty good. So, I mean, one thing, I mean, I mean, I mean one thing about me and games is, is that um, I don't really, I mean, it's, I mean, is that the fact I don't play games is because a lot of people kind of say you should play this game because it's fun. There's three things I actually like about games that I say in particular for me. I look at you know storyline, characters, and music. Those are my three topics right there. I look at. Now I play. I mean, I play random games where the storyline was horrible and the characters weren't all that, but the music was so great I had to keep playing it just to see the end boss. And I was like, oh wow, 
and you know that's that's I mean that's I man that's basically just how, how I roll I mean how I do things when I play games but those are basically just what I do so I just share it with everybody to say hey this is what I do when I play stuff I look at music characters and gameplay storyline but I mean storyline doesn't really I mean like storyline doesn't really care matter all that much anyway and characters are kind of pfft. so most time it's like music and other other stuff. Cause I mean, I mean, cause certain, I mean, like certain musics in certain games remind you of other games and stuff. So it's actually kind of like, oh my god, the music reminds me of this game. Oh wow, kind of like that. Um, other than that, um, so any for any um future projects for now, I am actually working on another RPG game, but um, I'm not probably gonna have that ready to go until next month. I'm actually gonna take my time on this. I'm not just, not gonna try to like to rush play it like I usually do, so I can hurry up and get it finished. Then sit there and go. Then sit there and go. Okay, I got it done. Let me go ahead on and upload it at the end of the week of the. I mean, at the last um day of this month. I probably just wait till next month to go ahead on and um do take care of that and try it out for myself and see how that is but um like I said before I am actually working on another RPG game so that's right that's gonna be um that's not gonna I mean that's not gonna be until next month almost say for right now is though it's on Super Nintendo that's as far as I'm gonna go with it I'm not gonna say what game it is I'll just I'll just let everybody be surprised when I upload it um I might actually do another game as well but it might not have commentary to it and the reason why is it though because the game itself the I mean like it has like so many I mean like the music is like so rocking there's really like no reason to really talk over the um soundtrack whatsoever and I'm just like I ain't that yeah I ain't talking over that soundtrack mm -mm. um other than that I haven't really actually planned it I mean I haven't actually actually planned anything in advance um I've already had ideas of what I'm gonna do in October September I don't know yet October I already have ideas going through my mind already I'm not gonna share what they are just yet I'm gonna wait until October gets there and see what happens see if I actually get me like another job or anything else like this and then um another thing about it was though because at the end of this month on the 31st if they don't change the day hopefully um I'm gonna get my hands on Ground Lancer 4 so that right there is gonna be my next PlayStation Portable game and hopefully that's not the last one that's gonna be out but a lot of people I mean you know looking at facts and looking over the um, game facts and looking at stuff like this it looks like it's gonna be the last game in the list so that's gonna be my last game I'm gonna be getting this month and I'm gonna get that out I'm gonna give that a shot see how that is cuz I'm a huge Ground Lancer fan ever like I said before I'm I think of my last update video the, when I first played Ground Lancer's Generations which is 2 and 3 I became a huge fan after that um, I played Ground Lancer 5 the game a lot of people say that it's the suckiest game of all time and I still get up and go wow seriously this no 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 I'm just like cuz I will see for a lot of people, like I said, for a lot of people who never played Ground Lancer 5 before, one thing about that game they did was though is that like Ground Lancer is most like a tactical type of game. What they did in the fifth game is they kind of took the tactical part out, and they kind of just made a regular RPG, just run around. I mean, just, you know, I mean, you run around from area to area to area, like big areas, and you fight off monsters on the fields when you fight monster in the fields it's still sort of tactical you can still like, tell people like attack here attack here attack here but what happens though you basically have like full control over the main characters you can basically like, run around and you can like attack monsters and stuff with the main character so I actually thought that was actually an improvement but some people probably got up and went no 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 they took out the tactical no you know I mean they, they took out the tactical element of that game and I'm just like well I mean you know they try something new and to me, it worked. What they did, um, I mean, like I said, I mean, I mean, I mean, like I said, I mean, it actually worked in my opinion. That Grand Lancer Five actually pretty good, but some people kind of say it isn't, and I'm not gonna sit here and try to argue or try to say you know what's good about it, what's bad about it, but. I, <sighs> Yeah, but that's like I said. Like I said before, I'm gonna get my hands on Grand Lancer Four. I'm still working on that RPG for next month, and um, I am still working on and probably gonna work on something else for next month. 
Um, also, before I actually stop this video for the day, I thought I'd also get up and say thank you for everybody who's seeing that pizza delivery thing. Um, like I was telling um, Izzy last night, and like I told a bunch of people earlier before, um, I actually thought of this idea. Yes, um, I actually thought of this idea on Wednesday, and I tried to figure out a way to actually incorporate it somehow, but I didn't have an idea, and so it took me a good little while to think about it. And I was like, "Well, I can use, I can use, I can use this game, but I need to have an idea for it. I'm trying to work around ideas for it, and I'm trying to think really, really hard. Cause I try, cause I, cause I, nah, sorry, cause I was gonna do it on Wednesday." upload it on Thursday and be done with it and then instead of, instead of me uploading it Thursday night I would upload it Wednesday night instead if I had it you know my mind working properly but you know, my, you know it's like after after me uploading Fantasy Star 3 my mom was kind of like and I couldn't think of anything so once I started recording my other Super Nintendo game my mind kicked in Thursday and I was like alright I got an idea so like I said before I came up wrapped up the idea together and then I and then I put together I listened to it myself a while and I was dying laughing after I did it and I sat there like I don't know this this will probably this probably may upset somebody or make somebody mad or something because I mean I know I should I, sh I mean I know for a lot of people out there I should basically think more positive but you know I'm not trying to I'm not trying to be a person who I mean, I mean, I like to joke around. I like to have fun, yes, but there's joking around and then there's looking crazy. And I'm not trying to look crazy. I'm just, you know, I'm trying to be like, you know, somebody who laughs, somebody who's around, but crazy, I'm not trying to be just <laughs> yes in that list. You know, I probably am by now, but I don't know. So, yeah, so, you know, so I'm glad everybody actually enjoyed that too. Like I said, if I actually had a good amount of fun actually putting that together, that was actually a whole lot of fun to me. Just sitting down, putting that, you know, putting that whole thing, putting that whole pizza delivery thing together. Just sitting here going, yeah, nah, and, you know, I did my own pizza delivery thing. Woohoo. I feel happy. Even though Gilgamesh will still never get his pizza still for some random reason. You know, no one shall succeed. Maybe Captain Tsubasa and Kamen Rider will, but nobody else wants to see you besides them two. Who knows? Um... <laughs> Anyway, so that's about all the updates that's been going on here for right now. Um, if I get another job offer or anything else goes on, I will make sure to pass that along, message along to anybody, and I'm going to keep working on this RPG game for next month, and that's about it. So this is Ryu here. Hope I wasn't going off on a huge tangent nonstop, and I will talk to you about later on then. Later.